Thank you. Hello everybody, my name is Craig Bennett and I'm the founder and owner of TechView Snelp. And today we are doing another Python tutorial. In this one, we're going to get into list. Now, as far as this goes, I know we didn't jump in and, and still hadn't right wrote a program, but we still have to cover these basic things because anyone from any skill level can come to this. And because of that, if you need a uh, review on what we covered in the past, then feel free to check out the card above and that will take you to the previous video. However, if you know about this and just want to skip ahead, feel free to do so and check out the card above. Now we'll let you go to the next video. If that video is not out, then the card will not be there. Keep in mind these videos come out once or twice a week, depending on my schedule. So, list. Let's uh, jump on into this. It's a pretty straightforward thing. To make a list, use the square brackets. And as you can see here, we can do a list. Like, like a string, we don't have to assign it to a variable, but it's a one-time use type of thing. If we sign it to a variable, we can recall it later, modify it, and a few other things. One thing to note is we cannot add integers to the list, but we can add a narrow list to our current list. So with this, this is a pretty good example where list, which equals one, two, three, and then we um, plus and four, five, and, and you can see here, works now if we want to add a single thing to the list we can do so by the pin body and right here as you see here it, it just added six uh, but um, if, if we go down to extend we can do the extend and add a couple things to the list now, if we did the append for this, adding a couple of things to the list, the problem that we'll run into is a uh, thing like this where it will add a list inside of a list. Because of this, we got to know how to remove things, either one or multiple things. And right here, we can do list.remove or, or whatever you call the variable, the variable for the list.remove and then put in whatever you want to remove and it will remove it as seen there and from here we um, if if that is not there then you'll get the following error and it just basically says that you cannot find it so that's a thing to note but anyways as far as that goes that's uh, pretty much about it I'm covering this video there's a few other things dealing with the list that I um, didn't cover yet but so it doesn't overload anyone and they can just review this as many times as they need i figured that that's all that needs to be covered in this particular video obviously when we get into coding we're going to get a little bit more advanced into this so keep that one in mind but uh, if you do have any questions or anything feel free to leave them in the comment section i'll try to answer it as quickly as possible please leave a like subscribe and share and i'll see you in the next video have a good day